Okay, well, I think that a criminal can sometimes repay their debt to society if the crime was like petty theft or something that you could probably give back to a person or return to them and it doesn't affect their life in a really drastic way. But if it's something that will permanently and irreversibly affect someone's life or the general community, I think that they will never be able to repay their debt to society. I think that a crimi criminal can pay their debt to society if the the crime was like not very severe, like it depends on the crime. If they like did petty theft or um, vandalized or something that's not a major crime, I think they can repay their debt. But if they murdered someone or raped someone or did something that they can't take back, I don't think that they're ever going to be able to repay. Um, do you think that a criminal can ever repay their debt to society? Yes. I think a criminal can repay their debt to society. Why do you think yes? I think it's just possible to make it up by doing good deeds and just being a good person. Uh, I think that it really depends on a case-to-case -case basis. If you're somebody who murdered someone, like James Holmes or something, like, you can never repay. If you're somebody who committed like a little misdemeanor or something like that, then I think that you should definitely be able to repay that debt to society, whatever it may be. Okay, depends on the crime. For example, how can you ever pay off your debt if you kill someone's baby? Or you, you know, hurt someone's child or their life chances in life by doing something crippling to them or something like that. How can you pay that back? You can't. Okay. Right? Right. <laughs> so it depends on the crime. Whereas if you, if it's a property crime, you take someone's property, you steal something, whatever. You can, you can make recompense for that because you can pay it back. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So is there justice is the question you should be asking. Okay. The question should not be, can you pay, can you, what was the exact question? Can you, can a criminal ever pay back their debt to society? I don't know. I mean, it's all in the eye of the beholder. Depends, to me, it depends on the crime. Okay. Yes and no. Right. Thank you. Do you think that a criminal can ever pay back their debt to society? I guess it depends on the case. I would have to go case by case basis. Okay. can ever pay back his or her debt to society? I would, I would have to say it depends on the crime. Right. First. Um, so yeah, I would, I would have to know what type, of, mm -hmm. what type of crime it would be in order to respond appropriately to that, <laughs> to that question. Good. Okay, so what do you think? Can you ever, like, can a criminal ever pay back their debt to society? I think that it depends on the crime. I think the word criminal is pretty broad. So... When it comes to certain things, like graffiti or even stealing money to some degree, like I think you can pay that back. But as far as murder and things like that, I, I don't know if you ever can because you've taken away something permanently from the, not just the life of the person, but all those around them. Yeah. I think that... Here he at least tried to repay his debt to society. He did his time in prison and reconciled and wrote this book to tell people about his experience. And I think that he did a good job of sort of acknowledging his mistakes and trying to make up for it. And since he didn't actually kill the police officer, I think there's something to be said for his ability to make up for his debt and to reconcile and that kind of thing. And so I think for the most part, he did, and he at least gets kudos for trying and at least attempting to reconcile and um, make things better for, for what he did. And since he didn't commit a serious crime, I think there's a little bit more leeway with whether or not he repaid his debt. And I think that, for the most part, he did. I think that Peary Thomas did pay his debt to society by um, writing this book and going to jail and changing his life around by, um, especially by writing the book, because when he wrote the book, he is expressing what happened to him and is teaching people that what he was doing was wrong and that maybe if people that are reading the book are experiencing the, th experiencing the same things that Peary went through, then maybe they will stop and think and won't do 
the bad things that Peary did. And I think that that definitely gives back to society and fixes partially the problems that um, Peary caused. But I think that if Peary had killed the police officer, I think it would be a much different story and that he wouldn't be able to fix his mistakes because by like taking away a life, there's no way to ever give that back. But I think that the fact that he didn't kill the police officer and the fact that he feels so bad about it, about just shooting him in the first place and that his whole life from up until then and going to prison, I think he um, changed his life and changed society.